Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be taking this 2021 Toyota Corolla. This one is the XSE trim and it is finished in Barcelona red. So I'm gonna go ahead and take it on a test drive and tell you exactly what I think about this XSE trim. Let's go ahead and take this 2021 Toyota Corolla on a test drive and see how it does. So, barely took this Toyota Corolla on the road, and I could tell you the engine is actually pretty responsive. Um, so, for the engine, it's a 2.0 naturally aspirated four cylinder engine connected to a CVT transmission, and it produces 169 horses and 151 pound feet of torque. And uh, the car feels nice and light. very direct you barely move the steering wheel and it just moves to the direction you want it to go it doesn't have pedal shifters and it feels very nice and smooth let's go ahead and take it on the highway and see how this Toyota Corolla does this one is the XSE trim that means that this one has the sport tuned suspension and it should be better than the other Corollas and it does have a CVT transmission suspension it doesn't feel not comfortable at all but there is a good amount of road noise that is coming from those tires those tires of course are bigger so of course you have to expect more uh, noise from them the setup on those rims they are 225 40 18 and this Corolla has the Toyota safe uh, safety sense it's the 2.0 so it has Linking assist, blind spot, adaptive cruise control, emergency braking. And to turn it on, just go ahead and click on the uh, set button. And that basically will turn on everything. But of course, you have to have everything turned on. Just go ahead and set it. And basically, it's driving by itself it's very loud when the pavement is not good so if there is like a really good pavement then there's not too much noise that is coming from the from those tires into the cabin but when the road is not paved then uh, it's uh, different it is a CVT transmission, but I love the fact that there is paddle shifters so you can control your gears. There is a V 
Import Mode. Let's go ahead and click on it. Definitely with sport mode, the engine is more responsive and uh, everything just becomes more aggressive. Definitely around corners, this car is really fun to drive because it's light. That's right, it doesn't have enough power, but seriously, it's nice and flat and I think it did a great job around that corner right there. So, uh, good job Toyota for making a car that handles very good. And of course, it, something like that is not expected from a Toyota, but I just love the fact that it handles very good around corners. So for the screen, it's an 8-inch screen. It does have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. And this one has a sunroof. And if you guys are curious about the fuel economy numbers, they are 31 in the city, 38 highway, and 34 combined from this 2.0 naturally aspirated engine. And I think those numbers are very, very impressive. Especially the highway numbers are 38, so I think those numbers are very impressive. With only 169 horsepower and 151 torque, I think those numbers are pretty good. Together. Here is the reverse just to show you how it looks like. So, guys, overall, I think this Toyota Corolla is really good. It's well put together. And I like the fact that there is a very good amount of soft materials. But guys, that's it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. I would like to thank Keith here at Colonial Toyota in Milford. If you guys are interested and if you guys are around, make sure to come check them out. I'm going to go ahead and put the information and link in the bottom of this video. And if you guys would like to see more videos like this, please subscribe. And as always, I'll see you next time.